don't know if you know it, but you won 71 of the 72 counties. What happened to that 72nd? <laughs> you got 48%. All right. I am very excited today to make a wonderful announcement for our campaign. Congressman Mark Buchan of Wisconsin is here to announce his support uh, for our campaign, and we're just very, very proud. Mark is going to be the chair of our Wisconsin uh, campaign. Mark, how are we going to do in Wisconsin in 2020? You know, unfortunately, we were embarrassed. Uh, Donald Trump won Wisconsin by 23,000 votes. But our problem was we had a big drop off in Democratic voters. About 250,000 Democrats that normally come out right? didn't come out. And the problem was they weren't mobilized and they weren't excited and invigorated. We share values, right? Those populist progressive values are so important. And more importantly, so do the American people. Poll after poll after poll, people support Medicare for all. They support the Green New Deal. They support us not getting involved in a bunch of military interventions around the world. And because of that, that's why you did so well, I think, in Wisconsin. You have always spoken truth to power. You know, your message on trade, uh, alone. I grew up in Kenosha, Wisconsin. 14,000 people out of 70,000 made cars when I was growing up. No one does today. There's an Amazon distribution center that was advertising last time I was there up to 12.75 an hour. Your parents made that three decades ago and that's what people are making now without the good family supporting benefits as well. People wanted change and Donald Trump lied to them uh, during the election, said he would bring them jobs and he didn't do any of that. Your position around working families and making sure that you can lift wages and have good family supporting jobs. Absolutely. We're desperate for that in Wisconsin. Look, together, you know what? We're going to beat Trump badly in Wisconsin. You getting those voters back, the fact that the three out of four young voters came out and voted for you, having that turnout come back, Wisconsin will be in the blue column. Well, let's go forward together. Absolutely.